what if during the interview you have been asked okay you have reversed the string that's fine i want to know what are the alternate ways that you can think of of reversing a string let's see how this can be done for this i'm going to take a string and going to have certain value let's say i'm going to say hello and then i am going to first show you the looping method using looping how can you reverse a string looping method to reverse a string now for this let's use for construct for and then i'll use a character let's see in s colon done now i want to to reverse now for reversing i am going to create a variable on top of it called reverse equals to a blank variable having no data here i am going to write the variable reverse string is equals to i am going to say c plus reverse string now why i am writing in this order why the order is important look at it when the loop initially runs imagine the very first character h is there in the variable c so what happens rs is initially blank so there is a blank one there is nothing not even space it is a blank so the very first value comes is h so now the rs has become h so h is here in the rs when the loop runs again the next character which will be sent is e in the c variable now e comes e plus h so e h it has become e h so now the output is e h r is output is e h the next character which will come is l so what happens l e h next comes l l l e h next comes o then o l l e h so at the end what is happening the entire string is getting reversed so now all i have to do simply say print and print the rs run it okay now the same thing if i simply opposite this for example i will say rs plus c if i do it is only print me hello you getting it how this is making a difference c plus rs if i do run the code you can see o l l e h is coming clear so now this is one way what is the other way there is also a function called reverse so i am going to use print and in the print i am going to use a blank string i mean there is nothing is blank dot i am going to say join dot join and use a parenthesis and in this i am going to say reversed function reversed and i am going to pass the variable which has to be reversed clear so look at it print there is a blank string i mean there is nothing it's completely blank not even a space dot join reversed as so if you print this way also you can see it is giving you output o l l e h now how this join works for example if i'm going to put a comma it is going to join each character with a comma see o comma l comma e comma e h so because i just want to reverse it i don't want a comma i am going to simply run this so o l l e h so now you have understood various methods starting from the slicing to the looping and to the reversed function to reverse a string let's see what is there in our next exercise and learn something new